Okay, this is division strategy three using a pencil, but it's the longer division technique. And if you're watching this video, you're doing really well. This is a year eight uh, strategy, really. Um, it's quite tricky to follow, but uh, there are two videos to show you uh, to see how you get on. Okay, in uh, this example, we have 405 cards, and we're going to split them into 15 packs. So obviously we're doing 405 divided by 15. We lay it out just like we have been with short division, but uh, in this case, we've got a, a bigger number on the outside here. It's not a, not a single digit um, times table number, so it's going to require a little bit more work. So we start, just as with uh, short division, we start from the left, looking at the first number, how many 15s are in 4. Obviously, there are no 15s in 4. So just like short division, we put naught at the top and we carry the 4 across. So far, it's exactly the same. Then we're looking at how many 15s go into 40. In this case, uh, 115 is 15. So I just uh, note them down over here. And you might need a bit of repeated addition. Um, for some of these, you probably won't know the times tables. So it's good to have a spare bit of paper just to jot these things down on. Two 15s are 30. Three 15s are 45. And at that point, we've gone past the 40. So just like with short division, we go to the nearest number we can get to uh, without going past the number we're looking for. So how many 15s are in 40? Well, there's, uh, there's two. So we put two at the top there. And just like with short division, we've got some remainders. We've got up to 30. So we have a remainder of 10. So to make it a bit easier, we could squeak, we could put the 10 in here, just like we have with the others, and, and make it 105. But the way most people do um, long division is they put the remainder down underneath. So the 10 goes down there. And they just drop the 5 down, just so you've got more space, basically. Um, but it's exactly the same as short division. It's just, if you could imagine the 10 being written in there, it would be quite small and messy. And it just gets a bit a bit, a bit squished. So basically, they drop, put the remainder underneath and drop the other number down next to it. Then it's how many fives are in 105. Uh, so we just carry on on our little 15 times table outside here. So 60, 75, 90. And there's 105, look. So it's uh, seven 15s make up 105. So seven goes at the top there, and that becomes your answer, 27, okay? So it's very similar to short division. Um, it's just a little bit harder because this isn't a regular times table. You have to um, possibly have a spare bit of paper to do some repeated addition to find out how many times the number goes into the number you're dividing uh, it into. Uh, and also you've got this little drop-down technique uh, just so it doesn't get, a, get too crowded up here. I'll show you one more example on the next example video.